This is Captain Mark Sheffer with your Lake Okeechobee Fishing Report with Bass Pro Shops Mania. Well, folks, the water's been kind of stable there, just a little bit over 11. We're at 11.3 and change. That's kind of fluctuating a little bit. Well, what that means, you get to all them outside grass edges. I've been having a lot of fun doing that here this past week, uh, easing down some grass lines. I haven't been able to get up on in a long time because it's been too skinny. And, I mean, it is skinny when you get up there. It's really shallow, and you think, oh, wow, the water's crystal clear. But there is fish up there, and, and we were fishing slow. Uh, we were fishing a Bass Pro Shop Sticko that I just got a box of them and took them out, and we started catching fish on them in June bug color and some other colors are working great, too. But uh, with that being said, that whole deal, as I was going through there, we were finding these patches of these beds that were there prior to the water going down and that's some shell cracker and the bluegills and, and once in a while you'll find a little bit of scattered shell cracker when you find a scattered shell cracker and you can't get them to eat that beetle spins try real earthworms uh, red wigglers are part of a night crawler for some reason they like those they, and uh, bluegills like the crickets but you'll find some good panfish up in those areas also and a lot of the bluegills, though, are offshore a little farther out. I'm seeing bluegills beds a mile offshore. They're, they're scattered all over the place. The south end of the lake is real, still real nice and clear, and you can see real well. The rim canal's been fun. I had uh, one breezy day. It was a little just too windy out there. We slipped in the rim canal. Hey, we caught fish. We just uh, wacky styled down the rim canal there and caught a few just here and there. It's, uh, one area we got into them pretty good. Uh, and th there's fish all up and down through there, especially on the mouth of the cuts. And also the bluegill, so accumulate around those mouths of those cuts. So uh, keep that in mind. Be safe out there because the water is still very low. But this is a great thing, and i got some shrimp grass on the line this week, uh, which I'm tickled to see. That means grass is really starting to grow off the bottom of the lake, and that's a beautiful thing for the big up. This is Captain Mark. All the best. Be safe.